Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com here. Coming at you with 2022-23, three and two baseball, 10 box, pick your team, number nine from jazbeescasebreaks.com. A very big thanks to this group for making it happen. Thanks to the, these, this group who got their team straight up on a true Tuesday. Michael, you ended up with a double last spot mojo with the Yankees and Cardinals. 70% of the time, last spot mojo hits 100% of the time. The rest of the teams we pulled for those that random number block randomizer, which I did in a separate video, which is uploading now. Yes. Here are the results. So it involves that group of teams right there, and it's a serial number break inside a picker team. Good luck. Now let's pop this case open. Let's see what we're going to pull out of here. We do have one more case loaded up, and I think that might be our last case for the time being. So it's in the shop right now. If you're watching live, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Pick up your teams before someone else does. Someone else will. All right, so that's what we're looking for out of here. All right, so there's, I'm gonna put the encased card or the encased memorabilia on top of the auto, and then we'll do this pack first right here. And obviously all card shape. Here's Francisco Alvarez to 50. It's gonna go to Greg in the Mets. And there's Eddie Murray, seven out of 99. For the O's, that's going to be for Francis. And Tyler Soderstrom, 17 out of 32. The relic is a 3 and 2 relic, 1 out of 2. Wow. Old New York baseball giant, Bobby Thompson. Six way relic. Kind of hard to see the dark purple foil against the dark gray, but you get the idea. Who's got my rivals, the Giants? That's a number block team. So that goes to San Francisco 1. And that'll be for James. James, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Nice. And the autograph is Harry Ford. Elite Extra Edition autograph, Harry Ford. Going to Seattle. That's a number block team, but this is not numbered. I guess there is that possibility. So I'll randomize this to one person in the random number block group. So since they're, they're autographs, what we're going to do is if there's any more non-numbered cards, we'll separate them out. So when I do the randomizer for the number block group, the name on top, number spot one, will get the Harry Ford. The next hit will be spot two, so on and so forth. All right, next up. My Dodgers should be able to close this out. They're up five, nothing. Bottom of the ninth, two outs. But the Rockies have two men on. Interesting. Oh. Oh, what are you doing? Phil Bickford just walked the bases loaded. Not my favorite root Dodger reliever. Yeah, Dave Roberts. Pull that guy. Come on, Phil. All right, here's a nice Drew Jones. Six out of 50. And there's Ryan Sandberg, five out of 99. 
Speaking of the Rockies, there's Zach Veen. That is one out of three, Zach Veen. And that is for Oliver and the Rockies. Hey, Oliver. All aboard the Big Head Express. Whoop, whoop. Also, the Cubs are a number block team. So that's going to go to Cubs 5. Uh, Chad O, you got the Diamondbacks. You get the Drew Jones. A's are a number block team. That goes to A's 7. That'll be for Matthew. The Orioles will go to Francis. The from Eddie Murray, that is. And the Mets were picked up straight up by Greg. All right. All right, the relic only is another old school player here, Ted Williams. Piece of his jersey, 10 out of 49. Game worn, game used. Red Sox, Brian. That's pretty cool. And the next one, it's a redemption. It is Jackson Curio. Cleveland or Brewers? Jason Curio is Cleveland. Jackson Curio, Milwaukee, I think. Your brothers. Jackson Curio. Wait for it. Is a brewer. Nice. Milwaukee Howard picked up the Brewers straight up. All right, nice, next box. That's the auto, let's put the relic on top. You can see all the action happening in the top camera up there. All right, we got the Babe, Babe Ruth. 105 out of 150 for the Yankees. Michael with the Bronx Bombers. There is Bob Gibson, 4 out of 25 for the Cardinals. It's also for Michael. And Hal Neuhauser for Detroit, 13 out of 25. That's for Detroit, 3 on the random number block. That's for Brian K. The Relic is Cam Collier, five out of 10 for the Red Legs. That's gonna to go to Howard in Cincinnati. Oh my God. Oh, <laughs> I thought that was out for a second. That's a long out by Evan Phillips. Could have been, a, had Grand Slam possibilities, but instead it's a harmless fly out. The autograph is Smoltzy, John Smoltz. 10 out of 10. By the way, Howard, Cam Collier, one of the bigger prospects in the Reds organization, Smoltzy, legend for Atlanta. That's going to go to Atlanta Zero. Atlanta's a number block team. And it'll be for Duncan. There you go, Duncan. All right, next box. The relic on top here. Let's move the relic over. Let's do the pack. And an A Rod, Alex Rodriguez, one of one. That's going to go to Seattle. Seattle is a number block team. James with Seattle one. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Pretty cool. It's a sharp looking card. Here's Big Boppy, David Ortiz, 39 out of 50 for Brian. And we got Bobby Miller. What a start to his career. 86 out of 150. That's for my Dodgers. And that's going to go to Dodgers 6. And it'll be for Nathan. And then, oh, that's the quad relic and autograph. Let's get the relic first. And it's a quad relic, one out of three. Prospect quad jerseys. Nick York, 
for the Red Sox. It's Brian Sullivan. Brian, out of fives and under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And then quad relic and autograph. Legend Steve Carlton, six out of ten. Quad relic and autograph. For the fighting Phils, that's going to be for Greg and the Phillies. Nice. Great stuff here. we got another case in the store right now. JaspiesCaseRace.com. Get your teams. Lock it in. Is that James Loney? Remember James Loney? He's doing uh, studio work, studio analyst work for the Dodgers Network here in L.A. J.D. Martinez has two home runs today. There's Nolan Ryan to 20. I think that's his 300. This is Rangers Nolan Ryan. That's going to go to Rangers 6. We've got old Dodger Maury Wills, 15 out of 150. Dodgers 5. Yeah, that is his 300. He had hit his 299 and 300. Jolanda Cepeda, 50 out of 150. Uh, that's for the Giants. Giants zero. That's going to go to. It's going to go to Duncan. All right. The relic is Andy Pajas. Twelve out of forty-nine. Dodgers are a number block team. It's one of the Dodgers prospects. That's going to go to Dodgers two. Eddie H. And the autograph is, is Dale Murphy. Six out of 25 for the ATL. Braves are a number block team. So this legendary signature going to Atlanta 6. Atlanta 6, Nathan. Got Daniel Espino, 12 out of 32 for Cleveland. Cleveland's a number block team, Cleveland 2. And we got Willie Stargell, 113 out of 150. Got to go to the Pirates, Pirates 3. Brian K. And then 119 out of 150, Joe Tinker. I believe. I think we had this player before. He's a cub, right? Yep, a cub. Cubs are a number block team, so that'll go to Cubs 9, and that'll be for Matthew. Yeah, I got it, Jan. Cubs. There's Tamar Johnson. Two-color patch. Prospect jerseys. 13 out of 25. I should know. I remember watching Joe Tinker, you know, work the infield. And Tamar Johnson is for the Pirates number three. Pirates three is Brian. And Cam Collier this time with an autograph. Nice patch, nice auto. 11 out of 12. Howard picked up the red straight out. There you go, Howard. Nice. All right, next. Yeah, that poem written uh, in a New York newspaper. Yeah. <laughs> 
I've lived so many lives. Those, those were the days. I remember listening to the old wireless, listening to the play-by-play. -play. And there's a Joe Tinker up the batters. That, that's what it sounded like. There's a Joe Tinker. And there's the hit. Goes to Joe Tinker, short to second to first, double play. I remember those days. There's Jordan Walker. 49 out of 99. How many walks does Jordan Walker have? That's what I'd like to know. Michael with the Cardinals. Got more Cardinals from Michael. Bob Gibson, 45 out of 150. And there's Gavin Stone on the horizon, 73 out of 150 for the Dodgers. There's three right there. Was there no radio when Tinker played? Sure there was. Spencer Jones, 26 out of 35. He played until 19, uh, 1916. There wasn't radio in 1916. Maybe it was just telegraph. And then they moved the pieces around the board. Spencer Jones for Michael and the Yankees. And the uh, Lone Star autograph, Colson Montgomery. 3 out of 25 for the White Sox. White Sox 3 will be for Brian. Maybe there wasn't radio back in 1916. Telegraph? When was the radio? 30s? I mean, I guess radio was, was in, in the works in the late 1800s. But I suppose radio as we know it, maybe baseball broadcasting probably didn't, didn't happen until, until a little bit later. What was the first baseball game broadcast on the radio? 5th of August, 1921, KDKA in Pittsburgh. So I remember old Joe Tinker when they, when they had the, those giant boards in, in front of department stores. And they would move around the pieces once they get the telegraph in to get the play-by-play. -play. I remember that. Old Joe Tinker. You know, you could hear the groans in the uh, in the crowd because they would put put them in a you know in front of department stores and they'd be, be a guy that moved the pieces around and when the double when the double play when that ball went to Joe Tinker everybody knew that's automatic out he's such a good good fielder it goes to Greg and the Mets there's Eddie Murray five out of five out of ten for Francis. You know, people throwing down newspapers, the Saturday Evening Post. There's Torrey Hunter, 72 out of 99. From Minnesota. And one out of three, Henry Davis. Quad Relic. Nice. The former number one overall pick. Did he get called up? Going to get called up? Pirates won. It's a number block team. Pittsburgh won. James. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Jan, is this off the top of your head or are you just looking up this information? Is KDKA the only station east of the Mississippi River with K instead of W in front of the name? That did strike me as weird seeing K. One out of five, we got Tamar Johnson. Another future prospect for the Pirates. Nice gold ink autograph. 
And that's another train whistle for Pirates 1. Another one for James. James! All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Jan, are you a, you could be a Jeopardy candidate with all that random knowledge. Yeah, that did strike me as odd. I was like, what? Pittsburgh? With a K in front of the radio call letters instead of a W. Is that the only station? Why? Do I? Do you know why? Ooh. I didn't see who the names were. I did see a dual autograph. Could be a randomizer. Could be one person happy, one person sad, or it could be one person really happy. First off, we got the Man of Steel, Ricky Henderson, 5 out of 10. A's 5. Greg. We got a Jim Tomey, 7 out of 25. Cleveland edition. That's going to go to Cleveland 7. It's going to be for Matthew. And we've got Robert Hassel, 26 out of 50 for Francis and the Nats. A former Padres prospect. All right, and your hits. we got a big two-color patch. Brandon Barrera. 22 out of 25. Toronto 2 for Eddie. The dual auto is is one team one happy person tigers tigers are a number block team 10 out of 15 tigers zero duncan with the number zero you get the jace young that's josh's brother jace young autograph and a jackson job autograph the plus one auto one plus one nice All right, final box coming up. Good luck. We got Johnny Bench, 89 out of 150. Cincinnati, that'll be for Howard. For Francis and Baltimore, there's Jim Palmer, 35 out of 39. Wikipedia says Pittsburgh is three radio stations with letter K? I thought it was just one. How did they get the K designation? Should be W. There's Buck Leonard, 10 out of 32. Uh, for the Homestead Grays, so that'll be a randomizer as well. Everyone will get a chance at this. And your final hits, we've got Termar Johnson. 34 out of 49. Pirates 4, Nathan. And the last auto is, is a train whistle auto. Cade Horton, here's a who. Three out of three for the Cubs. And Cubs 3, Cubs are a number block team, Cubs 3 for Brian K. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And there you have it, boys and girls. All right, now, let's see who gets some of this stuff here. Let's see who gets the uh, Buck Leonard. And let's see who gets this uh, Harry Ford. It was indeed before the FCC. So you're just saying things were running wild? But why only just one city? All right, so let's flip back to the screen over here. Let's do the, uh, let's do the Buck Leonard card first. We'll use same dice roll for all the randomizers. Let's randomize this. Two and a four and all the other lists six times. Team on top after six gets it. One, two, three, four, five, and six. 
after six times. Padres. Padres were picked up straight up. If it landed on a number block team, it would have gone to zero, but Padres were picked up straight up, so that goes to Francis. All right, now, Seattle was a number block team, but this does not have a number. All right, unless I'm blind. I don't think there is. Usually in the corners, usually in the middle, usually off to the side. No? On the back? No. So this will be name on top for the uh, number block group. So let's flip back to the number block group. Let's gather all the names. We'll go uh, randomize that two and a four six times. Name on top after six. Good luck. Two, three, four, five, and six. And that's going to be for Eddie Harden. There you go, Eddie. After six times, that Harry Ford card going your way. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That was three and two baseball. We've got another case in the store. Check it out. And I'll break some more of that with you next time. Bye-bye.